Then uh, Daily Mail, and it's uh, page 25, <coughs> warning over a, uh, a test for safe alcohol level in breast milk. Breast uh, milk's got alcohol in it. <laughs> I'm up for it. Well, it depends who your mum is. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is... Uh, this is a little screening test that is, is out today called, uh, by a company called Milk Screen. Uh, <laughs> lovely name. <laughs> and uh, you can actually test, screen your own <laughs> breast milk for alcohol content. Uh, there are worries, obviously, that, uh, that this is kind of, can lead to, I suppose, a bending of, of what is scientifically allowable. That there is, you know, w that there are certain parts of, uh, of alcohol to breast milk that perhaps the baby isn't going to become a raging alcoholic if it ingests it. Uh, but, of course... So, so if, if you drink while breastfeeding, your breast milk, it does become automatically infused with alcohol, then? Is that, yes. Is that, okay. Yes. If you, if, if you are drunk while breastfeeding, chances are your, your baby will also okay. be... You know, so it's I, quite serious, then? Of course it's quite yeah, yeah, serious, okay. and of course it will... Uh, did I not impart the seriousness? No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, you did, you did, you did, you did. <laughs> <laughs> Now I fully understand. Yeah. So, uh, and obviously, it's going to be it's going to be open to to slight abuse by by people going. We're here. I can drink as much as I want, up to a point. But of course, it affects. Just don't drink at all if you're breastfeeding. How about okay. that? That's you know, as a as a general well, what rule about of thumb. The celebratory fizz on the count of giving birth. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't have it, Carol. Don't have it, or you'll end up like me. <laughs> 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 Next story is uh, once again in the Daily Mirror, which is making the noise today. <laughs> um, it's uh, this is about children's clothes are going to have to get bigger because children are getting bigger. <laughs> um, as children are increasing their waist sizes, they're uh, they're going to measure. There's a, a group of companies, um, clothing companies are going to join forces to measure 6,000 boys and girls using high-tech scanners to see how the body shape has changed. Don't need the scanners, they're getting fatter, yep. they're just getting bigger. Okay. So soon we're going to have small, medium, large, extra large, and stop eating, <laughs> you're enormous! <laughs> <laughs> and the, well, uh, and the final story is a, quite a, uh, it's a lovely one, it's a bit of a head-pickling story, it's from the Daily Telegraph, it says that the universe is teeming with life, uh, big telescopes telling us that it's inevitable that there's not just going to be one planet uh, with life. There is probably going to be millions of planets. And some of it, some of this life could be in us. Alien life is already in us, apparently. Yeah, well, it was certainly in me last week, but that's now <laughs> over. Um, and I've, I've had an ointment to clear up that rash. Uh, no, it's, it, it, I mean, it's truly fascinating that... that, that, that I mean, they say it's not probably going to be uh, the coincidence of having life that is kind of like ours is obviously, yeah. it's way off the scale. But, you know, we'll find planets with bacteria. Mm, great. great. Yeah, great. After the ads.